You ready? Good morning. Once again, we're not able to be at church, and I hope once again to be there next Sunday. And we're going to do a quick children's moment this morning. And I actually remembered my glasses today, but maybe I won't need them. So I have Presley here with me again at Isley. Yay! And Brittany helping me. So today I'm going to ask, and everybody can do this at home too, if you brush your teeth, stand up. I was hoping you were going to stand up, and I hope everybody else stood up. Yeah. Nope, stand up. Now, if you like to eat sweet treats and candy, sit down. Yeah. We all need to be standing up and sitting down, I hope. So, if we eat a lot of candy, then what do we need to do to take care of our teeth? No, no, what do we, oh, no, oh, what do we need to do? Teeth. Brush our teeth. So, I got a toothbrush. We need to brush our teeth or your teeth get all what? Nasty. Nasty. Moldy. Yep, they get nasty. Your breath might stink, huh? <laughs> so, who do you think reminds us of a toothbrush? We're at Sunday School Children's Church. So who might be a toothbrush? I have no idea. Maybe God is like a toothbrush. How? Good he question. Keeps, he keeps you healthy like a toothbrush does. Well, let's say that sugar is like sin. So, you know, if you've got sin in your life, you know, what does it do to you? It brings you down. It makes you do bad things, right? Like sugar brings. Right, like sugar messes sugar. up your teeth, right? Yeah. So, if we have God in our lives, we can ask God to forgive us our sins, right? Yeah. And he comes in like this toothbrush. Mm -hmm. And he cleans us all up. Don't snatch. Just take it gently or people are going to think. Look at this. Thank you. He comes in and he cleans us all up. So the next time you have that candy and you go to brush your teeth and clean your teeth real good. So the next time you sin, what do you need to do? What do you do when you sin? Ask God. Ask God to forgive your sins. So God can clean your heart and clean your body. But let's also try to think twice before we let get tempted by something sinful, right? It, just think of what it will do to you. That's a good thing. Think what sin will do to you. It'll be like that candy and it'll decay you and it'll turn you away from God, right? Mm -hmm. So let's make sure that we keep our bodies and our spirit healthy and focus on God, especially while we're at home. Let's we'll still read our Bible. Let's still pray. And let's talk about God with those we have around us, right? So thank y'all again. I hope y'all are having a great week. I hope you're staying safe. And the next time you brush your teeth, let's uh, maybe think of God and say a prayer or two. Thank you.